Did anything get written in... No, oh, okay. I thought something was written in our diary. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. Oh, he's back. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. <laughs> you are so fucking dead. Oh, out comes the gun. Get off me, bro! Oh. Um. Yeah, I think he's had enough. Corin, stop it! Come on. Oh, oh, my head. Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? You and you, you're all dead. Let's go Still now. Get that fucking gun. Plus, my dad is on his way. You're all fucked. He owns you. Uh, no, he doesn't, because he's Even not your dad. Even if Nathan definitely deserved a beating, we should try to be better than that. Why well, you want me to rewind now? Oh, wait, how do I rewind? Is it, yeah, control. Shit. Yeah, there you go. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, what did you find? His room was clean and... How would we avoid that? What if we stay out of it? You like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this, motherfucker! Get off me! Please! Please stop! He's down! Hey, come on! Stop! I'm sorry. Yes, we have to go! Uh, I think taking the gun's a bad idea. Who's the bitch now? Chloe! Uh... Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was good. But scary. Um... Shit, man. This really hurts. Yeah, it probably should. I don't know what we should do. <laughs> I'm like so confused. Well, not, I'm not confused, but like I'm, I'm like torn apart. Is there anything that we can do? Like, do we have to put it back or something? Do we have to leave? I can't go back. So it's one or the other. What do I want to do? If we beat him up really bad, we might get in trouble. But if you only beat him up a little, and then he still has the gun. Because if we have the gun, yeah, we, we, let's let's not. I don't want I don't want us to have the gun. So we're Damn. basically gonna stop Warren. There, and then we leave. That was intense. <clears throat> Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For headbutting Nathan Prescott. That was awesome. I don't know. I almost went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better, um, 
Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Man, that guy like is so Warren. fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. Uh. Whenever I get a chance, I'm just gonna check my journal because I don't want to miss too much. Because I, I hate having to take like five, ten minutes and just reading. And if there's just so much of it, all I all I can really do is just go on each page for like a second and then if you guys want to read it you can but it kind of makes for bad content if I'm just sitting there reading God I hate seeing those poor whales like that Me too I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them Well that asshole is going to help us find Rachel Well that is went really deep what? fast You'll actually shoot him? Chloe do not count on my rewind Seriously Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So, let's play this cool, okay? Just... Talk to Frank so we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. I feel like something bad's gonna go down here. Oh, check the journal. Oh shit, yeah, there's a lot of writing. Uh, so after getting the inside info and assists from the other members of our team, Chloe and I made our way to the boys' dorm, aka Nathan's lair. Chloe stood guard out in the hall and I stealthed my way into Nathan's room. Uh, and even though I've become a master spy and detective, I still get surprised by things I see or find. Like Nathan's sleek, expressionist bro cave. It was like walking from light to shadow in a single step. I swear I could feel the temperature drop the second I walked in. But then Nathan knows photography, and he knows you have to keep the film and equipment chilled. I store my instant film hoard in Mr. Jefferson's classroom. Holy crap. Speaking of cold stuff, Nathan's room was layered in creepy shit. The disturbing but impressive photos, all the evidence from his father's bullying, and probably the most important clue we could ever find. Nathan's phone, likely loaded with messages and mysteries. It's not a good thing that I've internalized spying and stealing so, casu so casually over the past week. Every day here, am I right? And that's when Nathan Prescott showed up. He looked so wild-eyed and out of control that I felt a twinge of sympathy that he clearly needed help. But then I remembered he was also an asshole and had been extremely dangerous to me. Me, Chloe, and Kate. So before I had to rewind, Warren entered the scene and my white knight headbutted Nathan in perfect payback. I couldn't believe it. Neither could Nathan. In fact, Warren literally started to go ape all over Nathan's face. Um, <laughs> that can go two ways. I don't know why I mentioned that. I must have a dirty mind. I'm sorry. It wasn't cool, but my nerves were so frayed from the week and I was so over all the Blackwell bullies that I almost didn't want to stop Warren from beating Nathan into the floor. Warren has his own issues to work out with Nathan, but this wasn't the time or place. Even if Nathan deserved it, and I wouldn't have even... 
went and I would have been happy to watch war and show him who was a Blackwell boss now yeah really alright let's oh it's saving okay window look I don't think Frank listened to my cleaning advice it's not funny anyway I'm so dirty <laughs> What she was looking for, Chloe. She looks like sad. I, I'm worried for her. Can't see inside with this shit blocking the view. This is where Frank everything. ponders his existence and gets drunk. Take the trash out sometime, dude. Probably doesn't go out that often, though. Oh, fresh meat. So Pompidou must be okay. Good doggy. All right. Look. Chloe looks ready to rumble. Yeah, but she also kind of seems upset over something. <laughs> it's, it said speak, and all I do is... <laughs> oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? We just want to ask you some questions. You have some serious lady balls. Lady balls. No. Jesus, okay. Okay. But I'm not getting you high. <laughs> Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? You already did. Uh... You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. No, man, I do not get it, especially from a weirdo like you. You know, I hate the way you talk to me like you, like you know more than I do. No, no, I'm not. I, I... Oh, Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shit. You expect everything for free. You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. You snobby whores. Don't come into my home and judge me. That's why I go to church. And you want something from me? How about a blade up the ass, huh? Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch! Get it! Step the fuck back now! <laughs> Pompidou! You fucking killed my dog! Oh my god! Um... Um... <laughs> That just took a turn for the worse, like I expected, but, um, are we going to be able to rewind? Oh no! Chloe. I just shot a man and his dog. I killed Frank Bowers. You saved my life, Chloe. It, it, it was self-defense for both of us. Yeah. Max? Frank is really dead. I know. But we can't stop now. We have to find that code. Fast. Before the co cops come. Uh. So is this just how it is now? <laughs> That's it. Let's get out of here. Sorry, Frank. I'm sorry. Why? Why? Why are you leaving? If the you, you gotta clean things up by Jesus. letting the cops know. Chloe actually killed Frank. 
she'll never forgive herself or forget this. And only I can change it. But what are we going to do if we rewind? Let's, ah, I'll do it. Hello? Yeah, I was going to say go faster. <coughs> Whoa, we went far. Listen, Chloe. I can tell you for a fact that this will not go well. Max, I should have known you'd be kind and rewind. So tell me exactly what I need to do here. Um... Uh... Watch your mouth... Well, let's... Uh... I don't really want to get rid of the gun just to be sure, but watch your mouth or be careful. Uh, we'll try this. Please watch your mouth. You have no social skills here, and you will piss off Frank immediately. You kind of love this, don't you? Fine, I'll try being like you for a change. Or how you used to be. How you used to be? We'll see how this goes. Oh, look. The Wonder <coughs> Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? We just want to ask you some questions. You have some serious lady balls. <laughs> no. Jesus, okay. Okay. But I'm not getting you high. Close the door. No fight. No weapons. Frank, uh, your dog is kind of scary. Could you please close the RV door? You aim your gun at me, but you're scared of my dog. That figures. All right, now that's out of the way. Okay, there, you're safe. Now, what do you want? Just the names of some of your clients oh is that all oh well why didn't you just tell me how about i just give you the keys to my rv while i'm at it um you don't again. get it man this is for a good cause no man i do not get it especially from a weirdo like you you know i hate the way you talk to me like you like you know more than i do no no i'm not i Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shits. You expect everything for free. You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a I living. think I shouldn't understand. have made the same decision. Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. You snobby whores. Don't come into my home and judge me. That's why I go to church. And you want something from me? How about a blade up the ass, huh? Calm down, Frank. Let's just Don't talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch? Get it? Set the fuck back now! Oh my god! Gosh! Yeah, you actually shot me! I wasn't gonna hurt you! Oh, this fucking hurts! Oh, it hurts! Chloe! You shot him! I know! You're both fucking crazy! What do you want? We... we just want the code for your account book. Now! You're fine! Whatever! Just... just put the goddamn gun down! You already shot me, alright? There. Now leave me alone, alright? Just... Just get out of my life. Do you want us to call an ambulance, or...? No, thanks. You know what? I'll manage somehow without the police. Oh, right. Okay. Let's bounce. It wasn't the best way, but... I, 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 I guess he's still alive, and 
we got the code. <laughs> um. Shit. This could have gone way worse, but Frank might be more dangerous to Chloe now. <sighs> yes, Max, you can change all this if you want. Uh, no, fuck it. Because I don't really see how much better... Well, it could have probably could have gone better, but... I think we might as well just move forward. There might be consequences, but at the same time, he said he wasn't going to get the cops involved, so... Chloe, are you okay? Sorry, I, I just keep thinking about shooting Frank in the leg. Please don't. You saved us. Frank is lucky. We have to keep moving forward. All right. I um, better focus on this board and start tying these clues together. Okay. Thank you guys for watching, and be sure to leave a like if you've enjoyed, as it does help me out a lot. If you like the music you're currently listening to, click the music icon. And if you want, check out my other various social medias by clicking the logos or by checking the description box down below. Also, don't forget to check out my fellow YouTube friends in the list on my channel to the right side. And of course, don't forget to subscribe and be a part of the Clouder today. It's like Chowder, but with cats.